Hey everyone, Drew from Monkey's Tropicals Adventures, and the story I'm about to tell is actually true. So what are we going to talk about? So full disclosure, the fragrance I'm going to talk about was sent to me. However, I am going to give you my honest opinion, and this is my review. So the stories I'm about to tell are 100% true. As much as you don't want to believe them, they are true. Actually, you know what? Before we do that, why don't you subscribe to my channel? Why don't you? And then after this video, if you hate it, if you can't stand me, if you want to do a Reddit thread about me, then unsubscribe and do your Reddit thread. I don't think I'm big enough. Actually, I'm not big enough at all. Who am I? I don't know how to put this, but I'm kind of a big deal. Uh, Leave a comment, let me know what you think of the review, and once you're gonna hit that like button, and let's get on with it. So what are we gonna talk about? So I got a fragrance sent to me from Icon de Parfum. They are a new fragrance house out of Arizona. And they sent me this fragrance. It's a 50 ml. I believe it goes for about $39. And the one we're gonna talk about today is Glass Quartz. Glass Quartz. So here's the bottle. It's got the etched little eye, if you can see through there. It's kind of hard with the light shining. The little etched eye logo for Icon, and then you can see Glass Quartz etched in there. So I think the story behind Glass Quartz is uh, the owner played basketball and they used to play on these courts that were so slick that they nicknamed them the Glass Quartz. All right, easy enough. Fragrance notes. The only listed notes in this are Mandarin and Tonka. Uh, let's go and spray it. Very nice atomizer. Beautiful. Okay. So, this, in my opinion, is in the same vein as Aventus. That was my initial take on it, and I still kind of stand by that. If you like Aventus, I think you're going to like this fragrance. The only listed notes are Mandarin and Tonka. And then it gets into this, like, kind of like warm spun sugar, kind of like cotton candy vibe. All right, so since I got this on Saturday, I've worn it off and on, like at different occasions. Uh, throughout the weekend, I'd throw it on before bed. If I'm just walking around, I'd throw it on. So I've been trying it out, and then today I had a full wearing of it. So let's talk about the story that sounds like bullshit. So today, if you can tell, I have an eye sometimes that kind of droops. Well, this one right here. So my right eye today, I had an eye procedure. I had some donor tissue put in it. I'm okay, I think. Um, but I went to the eye surgeon today, and um, while I was waiting, I had this on. And the nurse said, you smell really nice. I said, thank you. And uh, I sat down and then I went in, I had my procedure and then I came out and you sit while you're waiting to check out. And it's a really big medical building. And um, so I'm sitting there and I think I hear my last name called. So I stand up, I said, hey, did you call my name? And one of the receptionists goes, oh yeah, but come all the way down here. I said, okay. So there's a, a lot, like a lot of receptionists there. So I get down to the end, there's like three receptionists. And um, they're like, oh my God, he smells really good. He smells really good. And they're like, what do you have on? And so I explain what I have on. And they're like, oh my God, it smells so good on you. You smell so good. I think I heard it smells so good on you. It smells so good like 10 times to the point where I was like, this, I gotta be on punk or something like that. Because if you've seen videos before where I talk about that, where people are like, you smell so good, get away from me. Like, oh. well, that, like it sounds just straight up bullshit. That's the story I'm telling, that's what it feels like I'm telling a bullshit story, but I had four people tell me how nice I smelled from wearing this fragrance today. Um, that says a lot about it. I've, I've never had that happen in that small of a concentration of people. Uh, the fact that I'm even shooting this and those statements make me nauseous <laughs> that uh, that's I'm, I'm taken back. So I had to I had to get this on video to talk about this. Um, so it, that, that's it obviously it garnishes compliments. So wear the hell out of this fragrance. Um, if you want to go on a date, if you want compliments, it's going to grab you compliments for sure. Like I said, Really juicy, lush mandarin mixed with that nice tonka, and then as it starts to dry, that spun warm sugar like cotton candy. It's not overly sweet, um, but it is sweet, but not overly sweet. It's not sickly sweet. Um, but I would wear it on a date. Uh, it's office safe. 
uh, the projection, I thought it was a medium projection. Apparently it's stronger than a medium projection. And the longevity, I got about six to eight hours on it. I reapplied a little bit around new, after worrying about six hours, I put like three more squirts on. So I think a total squirts, I might have six total squirts on my body from the time I got up and left for the office at six to the time I went to that appointment this afternoon. Um, it's an easy grab. That, that's the way I look at this fragrance. It's, it's just, it is a super easy grab. If you want to smell nice and you're looking at your collection, you're like, I don't know what I want to wear. I just want to wear something, and I'm going to say simple, but it's not a simple fragrance. But a simple, easy no-brainer is easy to grab this fragrance and you're going to smell great. It is versatile as far as the time of year that you wear it. You can wear it year round. I could see it. It's a little bit cooler weather today, but we're kind of having this weird thing where we're gonna have rain, but then it was a little bit warmer this weekend. People were at the beach. So it will do fine in warmer weather. I think perfect for spring or summer, but also pop in that cooler weather. The price, it's about 39 bucks for a 50 ml bottle. So it's very affordable, nice projection, Garnishes compliments, obviously. I'm I'm still taken back by by the compliments. Uh, again, I it sounds like bullshit, but that's what happened. True stories of fragrance wear reviewer. It's yeah. And then I came home. I was talking to my neighbor, and uh, he knows what I do for a living. But I was telling him like. We were talking about where I just came from and I was kind of telling him that story. He goes, oh yeah, man, you always do smell nice. And I was like, do you want some? So I gave him a decant and uh, he liked it. So this thing is, people people like it. I like it. People like it. You should get it. You will like it. I'm going to keep it just at that. Real simple. Not a simple fragrance, but an easy grab, affordable, compliment grabber. You're going to like it. That's it. That's all I can think of, is you're gonna like it. Only list of notes, Tonka and Mandarin. Drop a comment, let me know what you think. Have you tried this fragrance? Have you heard anything about this fragrance? I'm gonna leave a link where you can purchase this fragrance. And uh, check out my link tree now. I have a link tree, woo! In my link tree, <laughs> there's some discount codes for some uh, other fragrances, uh, for some rings. Takes you to the link to my Instagram. And I think that's it. I appreciate you guys watching, and I hope you guys have a great week. Stay safe, stay healthy, and I'll see you again. Take care.